and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mary Mother, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and now of our death. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mary Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and now of our death. death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mary Mother, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, sinners now and now of our death. death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and now of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and now of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and now of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and now of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and now of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was, was in the beginning, beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most need thy mercy. O oh, Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilfred, pray for us. The Second Sorrowful Mystery the scourging at the pillar. Pilate's next move was to take Jesus and have him scourge. Let us offer up our prayers for all those who are suffering either from physical or mental illness. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most need thy mercy. O Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilford, pray for us. The third sorrowful mystery, the crowning with thorns. They stripped off his clothes and wrapped him in a scarlet military cloak. Weaving a crown out of thorns, they fixed it on his head and stuck a reed in his right hand. Let's pray this decade for in thanksgiving for all of the good things we have. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give, Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mary Mother, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most need thy mercy. O Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilford, pray for us. The Four Sorrowful Mystery, Carrying of the Cross. Carrying the cross by himself, he went out to what is called the place of the skull. Let's offer our prayers for our Pope, our Bishop, and all the clergy and religious. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. O Mary, how we seek God's love for me today. And St. Wilfred, pray for us. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion. Jesus uttered a loud cry and said, Father, into your hands I commend my spirit. After he has said this, he expired. <clears throat> Let's offer this in preventions of abortions. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give, Give us this day our daily bread, bread and, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mary Mother, Mother of God, God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mary Mother, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mary Mother, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mary Mother, Mother of God, God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was, was in the beginning, beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most need thy mercy. O oh, Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. Hail, and St. Wilfred, pray for us. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, our life, our sweetness, our hope. To thee we cry for many shown of me. To thee we sin of our sighs, mourning, weeping, this valley of tears. Turn them, most gracious advocate, the nice and mercy towards us. And after this, our exile shown to us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, the Holy Mother of God, that we may be worthy of the promises of Christ. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant that we beseech thee, that meditating upon these mysteries of the most holy rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke be humbly pray, and do thou, Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, thrust into hell Satan and all evil spirits, who brought about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.
Good afternoon, everybody. Again, uh, today's uh, Mass is a uh, celebration of the Sacred Heart of Jesus, uh, First Friday observance. Uh, do remember, as we do pray to the Sacred Heart of Jesus for the conversion of sinners. We'll begin today's uh, uh, celebration by saying the entrance antiphon, Have mercy, mercy on me, O Lord, Lord, for I, I cry to you all, all the day long. O Lord, you are good and forgiving. All the mercy to all who call to you. And I'm going to throw you off just a little bit from your word among us or your uh, living with Christ being the first Friday. Well, we're going to take the mass from the sacred heart. So some of the prayers aren't going to quite line up with the, the book, but uh, we'll, we'll get through it together here as we celebrate the first Friday observance in the name of the father and the son, and the Holy spirit, Amen. the grace of our Lord, Jesus Christ, the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy spirit be with you all. Brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words and what I have done and what I have failed to do through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask the Blessed Mary, ever virgin, all the angels and saints, and to you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. Clothe us, Lord God, with the virtues of the heart of your Son, and set us aflame with your uh, with his love, that conformed to his image, we may merit a share in eternal redemption through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the first letter of St. Paul to the Corinthians, brothers and sisters, thus should one regard us, as servants of Christ and stewards of the mysteries of God. Now it is, of course, required of stewards that they be found trustworthy. It would not, uh, it does not concern me in the least that I be judged by you or any human tribunal. I do not even pass judgment on myself. I am not conscious of anything against me, but I do not thereby stand acquitted the one who judges me is the Lord. Therefore, do not make any judgment before the appointed time until the Lord comes, for he will bring to light what is hidden in darkness and will manifest the motives of our hearts, and then everyone will receive praise from God. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The salvation of the just comes from the Lord. The salvation of the just comes from the Lord. Trust in the Lord and do good that you may dwell in the land and be fed in security. Take delight in the Lord and he will grant you your heart's requests. The salvation of the just comes from the Lord. Commit to the Lord your way. Trust in him and he will act. He will make justice a dawn for you like the light bright as the noonday shall be your vindication. The salvation of the just comes from the Lord. Turn from evil and do good that you may abide forever. For the Lord loves what is right and forsakes not his uh, faithful ones. Criminals are destroyed and the poster, uh, pros, uh, posterity of uh, the wicked is cut off. The salvation of the just comes from the Lord. The salvation of the just is from the Lord. He is their refuge in time of distress. And the Lord helps them and delivers them. He delivers them from the wicked and saves them because they take refuge in him. Salvation of the just comes from the Lord. Alleluia, 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 alleluia. I am the light of the world, says the Lord. Whoever follows me will have the light of life. Alleluia, alleluia. Alleluia. The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory 
Glory to you, Lord. The scribes and the Pharisees said to Jesus, the disciples of John the Baptist uh, fast often and offer prayers, and the disciples of the Pharisees do the same, but yours eat and drink. Jesus answered them, can you make the wedding guests fast while the bridegroom is with them? But the day will come, and when the bridegroom is uh, taken away from them, then they will fast on in those days. And he also told them a parable. No one tears a piece of, from a new cloak to patch an old one. Otherwise, he will tear the new, and the piece from it will not match the old cloak. Likewise, no one pours a new wine into old wineskins. Otherwise, the new wine will burst the skins. It, and it will uh, be spilt, and the skins will be ruined. Rather, new skin wine must be poured into fresh wineskins, and no one who has been drinking old wine desires new, for he says the old is good. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise you, Lord Jesus Christ. We take away from uh, today's Gospels and reading is uh, Jesus coming into the world and, and kind of setting the world on its ear, uh, asking people to do something that really, from a world's point of view, doesn't make sense. But as he says, well, actually, it does. You know, think about it in a different way. And, of course, he uses the analogy of a, a person who has an old cloak, you know, and, and it's a trustworthy cloak. I, I have coats like that, you know, a coat that's been with you forever. And if you have husbands, you know exactly what I'm talking about because you want to throw that old cloak uh, coat away, but they won't because it's it's their, quote unquote, their favorite coat and has holes all over it. But would you go and take a, a new coat and snip away and get a patch from a new coat and put it on an old one? No, you wouldn't do that. But at the same time, we do have to recognize people are set in their ways. They, they like the, the old. And this is what Jesus says. Well, we need to be able to make sure that we are walking with Christ. And as he is setting us on our ear, we have to remember that it's going to be good for us. It, it will work for us. And to be patient, to be patient with those individuals that, that need to come to release that old, old coat, you know, to say, okay, I can let it go and, and put on a, a new one. So whenever I do have to say, whenever I read today's gospel, I'm always thinking of the old uh, detective show, Columbo. Remember his raincoat, and he would never give up that raincoat. But at the same time, there is some security that was found in that raincoat. Yes, the old ways, we do find security. But at the same time, we know deep in our heart, just like Columbo does too, you know, that there is a newer way and that, that it can be found in Christ and that we need to be able to set aside the old and, and bring forward the new. And so as we are celebrating the Sacred Heart of Jesus uh, today with the uh, First Friday Observance, I do remind you, as Pope Francis is asking us on this day, to fast, uh, to remember that uh, Fridays are always a, a day of abstinence, always remembering what Jesus gave when he gave his very self on the cross on Good Friday. These Fridays are, of the week are a reminder to us to always make sure that we are recognizing the love that Christ has for us, not from his mind and not from his soul, but from his very heart. And that very heart that was pierced with a lance and poured forth blood and water, the, the sign of the sacraments that are given to the church because of his love for us, not only just 2,000 years ago, but to the 21st century as well. So to that now, let us stand together, wanting to put off the old, but letting go gradually as we come to appreciate the new, looking forward to, to our, our time to be in heaven as our rural home is. We now turn to God as we make this transition in this world and this life and ask him to walk with us and to be with us as we present our prayers, our thanksgivings. So Heavenly Father, we always want to pray for the leadership of the church that you have established through the ministerium. So we do pray for Pope Francis and Bishop Donald and the successors of the apostles. Help Send your Holy Spirit upon them as they try to bring your gospel into the 21st century. We pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. And as we are observing this first Friday, help us always to be appreciative of that the great sacrifice that Jesus gave us here on the cross Heavenly Father, may we always uh, be very grateful for the gift of faith and to always open ourselves to, to coming to know you more and more through 
through this gift and also through the knowledge that, that can be given and gained for us uh, from the church. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now, Heavenly Father, we do present you, our farmers and ranchers now, as they are sacrificing their very lives for the feeding of, of the world. So bless them in, uh, in their uh, growing season as the harvest is also arriving as well to keep them safe. Heavenly Father, yes, we do pray by your continued blessings that they have a successful, a plentiful, and a profitable harvest this year. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. And Heavenly Father, we do recognize that though we're in South Dakota, we do also recognize the angst that does exist in the world. We are so blessed by, by having a society that, that is founded in a peaceful way. But now we ask you, Heavenly Father, from the consolations that we receive to bring those consolations to parts of the world, parts of our country, which is in desolation and, and uh, having so much angst because of the pandemic. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now, Heavenly Father, we present to you the for our doctors, the researchers who are trying to find a, a vaccine for uh, the coronavirus. Heavenly Father, send your Holy Spirit to be with them that they may find a quick uh, discovery and, and be able to stumble upon it by, by your graces that, that we may get over this period very quickly and find a healing uh, a remedy for the coronavirus amongst us. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. And on this, good fr on this uh, first Friday, Heavenly Father, help us also to find a spiritual vaccine for our lethargy, uh, our slothfulness. Heavenly Father, may we also come to know you better and, and be able to make the sacrifices necessary from this world so that we can gain eternal life. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now, Heavenly Father, we present to you all those individuals who, are, uh, who have died. Uh, we in particular remember the Larson family. You've taken so many away from them at uh, this is the last month. We remember now the Jackson family as well as they are now preparing to, to come to uh, St. Wilfred's for the burial of, of uh, their two family members. Heavenly Father, may we all recognize that this world is what is in transition and our eternal home is that in heaven. May those who have died share that promise of eternal life with you and, and Christ. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now we turn to you with those petitions that we hold dearest to our own hearts. For all of these, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. God, our Father, to understand perfect love is beyond us who are imperfect. And yet you sent your son to give his very self and give himself through his heart. Heavenly Father, now trusting in you, we present to you these petitions, knowing that you can make perfect what is imperfect in them. And to allow now Christ to work in, in us so that we can do your will. Hear these petitions that are presented to you through our mediator, Jesus Christ, who we know lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth, and work of human hands will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you. Fruit of the vine and work of human hands have become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever.
Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and good of all his holy church. O God, Father of mercies, who, because of the great love with which you loved us, which uh, untold good, uh, goodness gave us your only begotten Son, grant, we pray, that being perfectly united with him, we may offer you worthy homage through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your Lift up your hearts. Lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is, right and just. it is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty, and eternal God, through Christ our Lord. For raised up high on the cross, he gave himself up for us with a wonderful love and poured out blood and water from his pure side, the wellspring of the church sacraments. And so, one over to the open heart of the Savior, all might draw water joyfully from the springs of salvation. And so, with all the angels and saints, we praise you as without end we acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord, God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the font of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and, giving thanks, broke it, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more, giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is a chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks you've us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly, we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, and Donald, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress. As we await the blessed hope, and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will. Live and reign forever and ever. Amen. Peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. 
Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. And again, if you take up your um, word among us or you're living with Christ, let us say together the communion the antiphon. How great is the goodness, Lord, that you keep those who fear you. And again, in your charity today, do remember to, as we are celebrating the first Friday, the Mass of the Sacred Heart, let's pray for the conversion of sinners, those who do not know Jesus, that they come to know him better, they may turn to him in his sacred heart. And let us pray. Made partakers of your sacrament of charity, we humbly implore your mercy, Lord, that we may be conformed to Christ on earth and merit to be co-heirs of his glory in heaven, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And Almighty God bless you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be God. And a reminder that uh, tomorrow, uh, 8.30 Mass uh, in the morning, and then, of course, uh, preparing for uh, Mass uh, in Artesian. It's going to be at 5.